love the color. <laughs> yes. The color of the reel. It's yeah. purple. Girl, love you it. look so good yes. in person. Welcome yeah. to the show. Hey, Body down. Uh, not hey. Okay, so you are a big WWE star now, yes. but we heard that when you were a little girl watching wrestling, your mom would make you turn it off. Oh, yes. When I first started watching wrestling, I remember I turned on the TV because there's nothing on, and my mom came in and was like, what are you watching? This is bad. <laughs> so I was like, um, I like it. So I snuck into my brother's room and continued watching, and then ever since then I knew I wanted to be a WWE superstar. Hey. Now I'm all right. Cool. <laughs> so is your mom a fan now? My mom's the biggest fan. Um, she was actually that. at the show on Monday, and I just saw her in the front row, and I'm like, don't make any noises. I can see you. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I love the fact that family is very important to you. Yeah. That's always a beautiful thing. And you've got some pretty uh, famous cousins. You want to let us know who those people are <laughs> in your family tree? Yeah, so my first cousin is Snoop Doggy Dog. Hey. And then once I came to the WWE, I kind of found out that I was related to uh, Brandy and Ray J, too. But I never met them. Wait, really? No yeah. <laughs> How did you find out? People just tweeted me that I was related, and I saw on my Wikipedia page, so I was like, maybe it's true. Yeah, but who oh, is wow. okay, We need to verify <laughs> yeah. that. We are good friends with Ray J. Ray J and Brandy are friends of the show. Yeah. We're gonna find that if yeah, that's find true. That out. Let's do a DNA test, huh? There yeah. we go. Okay. You guys could be cousins. That would be cool. <laughs> well, your persona in the ring is the boss. Yes. How'd you come up with that? I actually got it from Snoop Dogg. Um, really? Yeah, I remember being around him when I was little and just thinking when I got signed, I'm like, I need a persona that's larger than life. Because mm -hmm. I knew when I was out in the ring that I was the very best, but I was so nervous and so shy when I first started. And I was like, you know what? People around him call him the boss. So I'm like, I'm gonna take that and make myself the legit boss because I'm more legit than him. Oh! oh. Ooh, I heard that. Well, all right. You know what I always <laughs> want to know about wrestlers? Does your personality change when you get in the ring? Because I mean, I feel like you ain't gonna beat me up, but if I get in the ring with you, you kick my ass, right? Always. I always feel like when that red light comes on, I'm a whole different person. Like, when I'm back at home, I'm just this anime nerd who wants to, like, sleep on her couch all day, but when I'm in that ring, I want to be larger than life, and I want to show the world that I'm the very best at what I do. That all is right. awesome. Like it. So empowering. So, if you were to fight someone who isn't a professional wrestler, who would it be? Ooh, I would have to choose um, Mark Ruffalo. Ooh. Only because I have a big crush on him. I he think plays the Hulk. Wait, yeah. 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 you have a crush on him? You want to beat him up? Yeah, you want to fight him? Yeah. <laughs> See, that's hot. <laughs> Wait, that makes me picture things. Does that mean you take some of your moves into the bedroom sometimes? Uh, maybe you have to ask my husband that. Maybe. Okay. I don't know. Okay. okay. He's your hall pass. I got it. Okay, <laughs> we'll remember that. So Halloween, Halloween is right around the corner. Do you have people dress up like you? Always, yes. It's so cool. Every time we come, like, have shows, I see little girls dress up as me. And actually, every year for Halloween, I have this contest called the Legit Boss Halloween. And, uh, you know, people dress up as me. And ever, whoever has, like, the best costume, I always send them, like, a little gift. So. Oh, that's yeah. so yeah. sweet. So you see, now you know what your costume will be for this Halloween. <laughs> now, sweet. your husband, Sarah, is actually a costume designer yeah. for the WWE. So I have to ask, oh, my god, you guys oh, are so, so cute, cute together. Uh -huh. Do you guys ever argue about what you're going to wear? Always. If he doesn't really? make me look the best, then there's a problem at home. And uh, <laughs> but he's, he's always the best. He always makes me look the best. And he actually made my wedding dress too. He's Wait, no way. Yeah. That is super romantic. Yeah. Cool. Wait, he made okay. He made your wedding dress with your ideas in mind. And how does that work with like, you know, they say you're not supposed to see the bride's <laughs> dress before, and he actually yeah, made it. So yeah. non-traditional. We had we got married in my backyard, and uh, he just he made me look amazing. I love it. Oh, wow. that's so sweet. Wow. You know what? I'm so excited because you're about to fight in the first ever all-female pay-per-view wow. event. It's Woo! called Evolution. So cool. This is like groundbreaking. Yes. Why do you think this event is so empowering to women? Because it's a long time coming. I feel like for women, we always had a fight to be the showcase, and now I feel like we don't have to fight anymore. It's the first ever all women's pay-per-view. There's no men involved. Wow. No, every single woman's yeah. performing, yeah. and I just know that this Sunday it's just going to be groundbreaking, and we're going to make history yet again. And I'm, I'm going to be watching. Be part of it. Uh, yes. I'm definitely. a big fan. I love it. That's so yeah. cool. Sasha, thank you so much for stopping by. Yes. 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 Awesome. You can get Sasha and the rest of the ladies on their WWE on their pay-per-view event Evolution, October 28th. Mark your dates. Available on the WWE Network.